do the intro. No, I, I did the intro on the last. I, you could do that, and then I'll do mine. Don't worry about it. I'll do one, and then you do one, and we'll just post this video to both channels. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what up, everybody? Welcome to this a brand new reaction channel, B Hall's Breakdown. I'm B Hall. I'm here to break it down. Oh, uh, you can edit this, right? Yeah, like, of put course. It All the dead okay. space is gone. You don't worry about it. It's not like we're live. Guys, like the video if you enjoy. Dang, Rob kind of looks like a beast. I know. Look at Maddie. Hey, oh, it's a new guy. Oh, so it was Eric pause screaming. It. Pause it. So that was Eric screaming. Yeah, I told so you. I, in my video, guys, I um, I didn't know who was doing this. I'm like, is that Craig? Okay, Craig. Because there was like the, I think it was towards the end of the the bridge. He had like a, a false chord, and I was like, I haven't heard a false chord or anything close to that. Whatever Craig used to do in this war is ours. You know what I'm saying? Maybe, maybe, yeah. maybe not so much. Yeah, but now maybe. that Shreds is an official part of the band, they want to incorporate it more, so that's why they did this with this song. Oh. Hey. Oh, I got a little uh, bless the fall through back there with that with Craig in that circle. <laughs> oh, you, you know what I'm saying? Now? Yeah, I know what you're saying. Wow, that is a <laughs> that is a reach back to MySpace era. Oh my goodness, do you still have a MySpace? I can't get into it, but I do. <laughs> have it's you seen what that there, website looks like now? Uh, it's so crazy. I went on there the other day. I'm like, what the heck is this? It's so brand new. We should revive MySpace. So let's single-handedly bring back MySpace. Guys, if this video gets 10 likes, we'll start posting on MySpace. Dude, I like it. It's like got the cyberpunk. You know what this reminds me of? Have you guys never seen the YouTuber Nerd City? This is what his stuff looks like. Like, his, all his YouTube videos look like this. It's kind of crazy. But he does, like, commentary drama. I don't know why I'm holding a set of keys for this. I'm sorry. I'm not ready to let you go. They look dope. It's dope as hell. Whoa. Had worms all over him. Did he? Yeah. I noticed the blood. Right there. That was yeah. what, that's what made me question it the last time. I was like, oh. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's so weird because yeah. they're everyone's so. It it, it it feels like they've been here a while, but if it, it feels like everyone's still so brand new. Other than mm -hmm. Craig and Rob, Rob being the only and original TJ. member. TJ's been there TJ. for a while now. Yeah. Yeah. Got he he came on. Was it when was it Max that got kicked off? Yeah, I think so. I think TJ replaced Max as bassist. And then he pl started playing guitar when the Monty brothers left and Kevin came. Mm hmm. That's crazy. They've had so many band member changes. I know. That's crazy to think about. You never really think about something like that. No, but like me and the wife were talking the other day. And if you think about it, a band never really changes, no matter the members, unless the lead singer, then the band changes. Yeah, well, I mean, you can't really. You, you can. Technically, this can sound so bad when I say it. The musical aspect of it can be recreated by other people with different visions, if you know what I mean. However, yeah. the vocals completely change the narrative. Like, if someone has a deeper voice, it's probably going to be a bit more serious, slower, methodical song. Kind of like uh, if you were to put um, the guy from Sleep Token in Escape the Fate, way different. Yeah. Absolutely. If you put Craig Mabbitt in Sleep Token, oh my way God. different. Right. I'm sorry. This makes no oh, sense. Yeah, we, let's go back to the video. <laughs> hey. 
Hey. Saw the worms that time? Yeah, I saw that on his face. This is the new age rock stuff. I'm sorry, I cut it off right on the breakdown when we rewind it. Oh, it, it, it's one of those moments where it feels like, oh, we're back. We're back. We're back, no, right? Because we had it, it, the it, Chemical Warfare song or album, right? And it was yep. like, I'm going to be real. Eh. Eh. I mean, there, there, were some, there were some bangers on that album. I'm not going to lie. There are a couple bangers that are on the main playlist when you're in the car. You turn that on right away. However, these, these past few songs, right, have been mainstays for me, right? I don't I'm know what it lie. is. I still have hate myself on repeat all the yeah, time. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, this, <laughs> it, it, feels, it feels familiar, but it feels fresh. It doesn't feel like they reinvented anything. Like, they didn't go back to old Escape to Fate. They aren't current Escape to Fate. This is, like, new, fresh, but familiar. I don't know. Maybe yep. we, you know what? Maybe we get Craig. Oh, you know what we do? We get what? um, we get Craig to watch this video with us, right? And then we make a video on that. Yeah. And I ask him, what was your creative writing process for these songs? How did it go about? Because these songs have all these different, like, I said it in the last video, has all these different fundamentals, all these different aspects of music and different things going on, all these tricks coming out of the bag. And it's like, it's not like they're throwing everything at a fan and hoping it's music. It seems like it's yeah. orchestrated. I don't know. Maybe I'm yep, crazy. I, I feel like they have more creative control over this, their new stuff. Like, I've heard Craig say it and talking to him. They're trying to recreate their old sound that mm -hmm. everybody loved with the new sound and kind of mash it up. I really like so what they're with the singles too, just dropping them yeah. instead of just waiting yeah. for an album. <laughs> Ooh. Mm. That is a rock song that it had guitars. <laughs> yeah. You know, Imagine honestly, I've, say. I've listened to this song a lot recently, but watching it with the video, it just gives it a whole new perspective for me. Personality wise. Oh my goodness. Uh, we got to meet up with that. I got to meet up with that guy, Matt. You said he's cool. You've done things. I mean, you drove driven him home or some whatever. Hung out with him. Yeah. Tell that. It, Matty, if you're watching this, bro. Play COD with us, bro. We dropping in the war zone all the time. Love to love to get an interview. That'd be dope. I mean, we've interviewed Craig a million times. We haven't interviewed anybody, actually. Oh, we were supposed to, but we never did. We never, we never did it. Listen, Matty, if you see this, let's get an interview. You're the new guy. You're the young gun. You have everything to prove. Where was he from before? I know. Wasn't he supposed um, to be in Falling Reverse? No. He had a thing with Falling in Reverse. He was in a couple other bands. He was actually in a band with Monty Money. Uh -huh. uh, what the? What the? He was in Beyond Unbroken. Mm -hmm. uh, I think the name of his other band was Vampires Everywhere. <laughs> Craig, if you're watching, Craig, you already know. If he sees this, he knows. He's already. What's up, right? Like, hello. Yeah. If we don't do the interview, then that's not going to make any sense that it's in the video. So, listen, Craig, we got to get an interview with you, Maddie, everyone else. Listen, let's guys, go. let's go. You want to? I love you guys. Be good, be kind, be safe to each other. I'll see you on the next one. Be all, send them away. All right.
like I said, brand new channel, B Hall's Breakdown. I'm B Hall. We broke it down. If you like it, like, subscribe, comment. I'll see you in the next one.